Narcan nasal spray is not a substitute for emergency medical care. As with any drug, you need to be aware of important safety information concerning its use. Please see indications and important safety information at the end of this video. Also, please see accompanying full prescribing information in the use of this product. Narcan nasal spray is an emergency treatment for a known or suspected opioid overdose. The appropriate use of Narcan nasal spray can help reverse an overdose. Narcan nasal spray is not a substitute for emergency medical care. As with any drug, you need to be aware of important safety information concerning its use. If you encounter someone who is unresponsive and you suspect an overdose, first shake their shoulders, shout their name, Kevin, and ask if he or she is okay. Hey, can you hear me? Then check for signs of an overdose. Unresponsive to touch or voice. Breathing is slow, uneven, or has stopped. <sighs> Snoring, gasping, or gurgling sounds. Fingernails or lips are blue or purple. Administer Narcan nasal spray as quickly as possible if someone is unresponsive and an opioid overdose is suspected, even when in doubt, because prolonged respiratory depression may result in damage to the central nervous system or even death. Lay the person on their back to receive a dose of Narcan nasal spray. Remove Narcan nasal spray from the box. Peel back the tab with the circle to open the Narcan nasal spray blister pack. Remove and review the printed quick start guide inside the package. Hold the Narcan nasal spray with your thumb on the bottom of the plunger and your first and middle fingers on either side of the nozzle. Do not press the plunger to test or prime the device. If you do, you will waste all or part of the dose of medication. Tilt the person's head back and provide support under the neck with your hand. Gently insert the tip of the nozzle into one nostril until your fingers on either side of the nozzle are against the person's nose. Press the plunger firmly to give the full dose of Narcan nasal spray. Remove the device from the nostril after giving the dose. After you have given this medication, seek emergency help right away. Narcan nasal spray is not a substitute for emergency medical care. Move the person on their side after giving Narcan nasal spray. If possible, put their hands under their head and bend their upper leg forward. This helps prevent the person from rolling onto their stomach. This is known as the recovery position. Continue to watch the person closely. If they do not wake up or respond to your voice or touch, or if they do not seem to be breathing normally within two to three minutes, use a new Narcan nasal spray to give an additional dose in the other nostril. Acute opiate withdrawal symptoms may occur from use of Narcan nasal spray in patients who are opioid dependent. Symptoms include body aches, diarrhea, increased heart rate or tachycardia, fever, runny nose, sneezing, goosebumps, also known as piloerection, sweating, yawning, nausea or vomiting, nervousness, restlessness or irritability, shivering or trembling, abdominal cramps, weakness and increased blood pressure. When the emergency is over, put the Narcan nasal spray back in its box and throw it away in a place that is away from the reach of children. In addition to watching this video, please read the quick start guide that comes with Narcan nasal spray before using it. Talk to a healthcare professional if you have any questions about how to administer Narcan nasal spray. Please read the indications and important safety information that follows. Store Narcan nasal spray in the blister and cartons provided. Store below 77 degrees Fahrenheit, 25 degrees Celsius. Excursions permitted up to 104 degrees Fahrenheit, 40 degrees Celsius. Do not freeze or expose to excessive heat above 104 degrees Fahrenheit, 40 degrees Celsius. Protect from light. Narcan nasal spray freezes at temperatures below 5 degrees Fahrenheit, negative 15 degrees Celsius. If this happens, the device will not spray. If Narcan nasal spray is frozen and is needed in an emergency, do not wait for Narcan nasal spray to thaw. Get emergency medical help right away. However, Narcan nasal spray may be thawed by allowing it to sit at room temperature for 15 minutes, and it may still be used if it has been thawed after being previously frozen. What is Narcan nasal spray? Narcan nasal spray is a prescription medicine used for the treatment of a known or suspected opioid overdose emergency with signs of breathing problems and severe sleepiness or not being able to respond. Narcan nasal spray is to be given right away and does not take the place of emergency medical care. 
Get emergency medical help right away after giving the first dose of Narcan nasal spray, even if the person wakes up. Narcan nasal spray is safe and effective in children for known or suspected opioid overdose. Important safety information. Who should not use Narcan nasal spray? Do not use Narcan nasal spray if you are allergic to naloxone hydrochloride or any of the ingredients in Narcan nasal spray. What is the most important information I should know about Narcan nasal spray? Narcan nasal spray is used to temporarily reverse the effects of opioid medicines. The medicine in Narcan nasal spray has no effect in people who are not taking opioid medicines. Always carry Narcan nasal spray with you in case of an opioid overdose. 1. Use Narcan nasal spray right away if you or your caregiver thinks signs or symptoms of an opioid overdose are present, even if you are not sure, because an opioid overdose can cause severe injury or death. Signs and symptoms of an opioid overdose may include unusual sleepiness and you are not able to awaken the person with a loud voice or by rubbing firmly on the middle of their chest, sternum. Breathing problems including slow or shallow breathing and someone difficult to awaken or who looks like they are not breathing. The black circle in the center of the colored part of the eye, pupil, is very small, sometimes called pinpoint pupils and someone difficult to awaken. Family members, caregivers, or other people who may have to use Narcan nasal spray in an opioid overdose should know where Narcan nasal spray is stored and how to give Narcan nasal spray before an opioid overdose happens. 3. Get emergency medical help right away after giving the first dose of Narcan nasal spray. Rescue breathing or CPR, cardiopulmonary resuscitation, may be given while waiting for emergency medical help. 4. The signs and symptoms of an opioid overdose can return after Narcan nasal spray is given. If this happens, give another dose after two to three minutes using a new Narcan nasal spray device and watch the person closely until emergency help is received. What should I tell my healthcare provider before using Narcan nasal spray? Before using Narcan nasal spray, tell your healthcare provider about all of your medical conditions, including if you have heart problems, are pregnant or plan to become pregnant, Use of Narcan nasal spray may cause withdrawal symptoms in your unborn baby. Your unborn baby should be examined by a healthcare provider right away after you use Narcan nasal spray. Are breastfeeding or plan to breastfeed? It is not known if Narcan nasal spray passes into your breast milk. Tell your healthcare provider about the medicines you take, including prescription and over-the-counter medicines, drugs, vitamins, and herbal supplements. What are the possible side effects of Narcan nasal spray? Narcan nasal spray may cause serious side effects, including sudden opioid withdrawal symptoms, which can be severe. In someone who has been using opioids regularly, opioid withdrawal symptoms can happen suddenly after receiving Narcan nasal spray and may include body aches, diarrhea, increased heart rate, fever, runny nose, sneezing, goosebumps, sweating, yawning, nausea or vomiting, nervousness, restlessness or irritability, shivering or trembling, stomach cramping, weakness, increased blood pressure. Some patients may show aggressive behavior upon abrupt reversal of an opioid overdose. In infants under four weeks old who have been receiving opioids regularly, sudden opioid withdrawal may be life-threatening if not treated the right way. Signs and symptoms include seizures, crying more than usual, and increased reflexes. These are not all of the possible side effects of Narcan nasal spray. Call your doctor for medical advice about side effects. You may report side effects to the FDA at 1-800-FDA-1088 or www.fda.gov medwatch. Please see full prescribing information.